Lots of shuffling and leapfrogging, not only in the division, but also in the AL wildcard standings. The Mariners are a half game behind the Houston Astros. As Altuve digs in, all set to go against Luis Castillo, making his 32nd start. 14 game winner this year, ERA just over three for him. It's really pitched well for the Mariners. 99 on the crosshairs. What a start for Luis Castillo. Strikes out the first batter that he faces. A tough man to strike out. Two out and no one on now for the designated hitter, Jordan Alvarez, batting 295. And Alvarez smokes this one toward left center field. That's going to be down for extra bases. Go all the way to the wall. Alvarez on his way to second base as it's picked up by Canzone. And it's a double for Jordan who's now 4 for 10 in his career off Castillo. It's Kyle Tucker. The 0-1 pitch, swinging a ground ball to Wormburner, right to Ty France at first. Underhand flip to Luis, covering first on the play. And it's in time to get Tucker. That's going to retire the side. Right here in this ballpark, Justin is 9-6 and six with a 3.56 in 18 career starts. J.P. Crawford leads it off. And that's a ground ball hit softly right side to his right of Brayu. He has it underhands to Verlander in plenty of time, and there's one out. Mariners are facing Verlander for the first time since game one of the divisional series last year in Houston. Now the 2-1. Curveball again, and that's hit the other way. And caught by Abreu sprawling to his left. Hit the ground after coming up with that ball with a lunge, and that's the second out. Cal Raleigh skies one to right field. He got under it a bit because he hit this way up in the air. But Kyle Tucker waits for it and puts it away for the final out of the inning. Jose Abreu leads it off against Luis Castillo. And that's hit out in the right center field. Rodriguez on his horse. He won't be able to get there as that splits the gap. Then it hits off Rodriguez's glove. Goes to the wall. Abreu around second and on his way to third. Crawford won't make a relay. And Abreu is at third with nobody out. Abreu stays at third and there's one away. So now one out. Infield stays in for Jeremy Pena. On the edge. Splits it at 99 again. The Astros now have just one shot at it with Mauricio Dubon standing in. And Dubon shoots this one in the right center field. Rodriguez over, won't get there, drops it for a base hit. Abreu can walk home. Mauricio Dubon with the big two-out RBI single. one nothing Astros. He's at first with two out for Martin Maldonado. This ball hit well into left center field. If this goes to the wall, Dubon might score. It does go to the wall. He will score. Astros take a 2 nothing lead. Martin Maldonado delivers a two-out RBI double. Here's Jose Altuve. He struck out looking his first time up. Castillo delivers. And Altuve ropes this one in the left center. That's a base hit. Maldonado around third. He'll score. It's an RBI single for Jose Altuve. Three two-out runs for the Astros. Up three to nothing in the top of the second. Verlander the kick and the pitch. Swing and a miss. Got him on a slider away. First strikeout for Verlander in the 200th time. Teoscar Hernandez has struck out this season. One out. Got him upstairs. Justin Verlander back-to-back -back strikeouts. Both swinging. Getting Teoscar Hernandez and Jared Kelnick. Swing and a miss. Got him on a high fastball. Justin Verlander strikes out the side. We're through two innings in Seattle. Astros three, Mariners nothing. Top of the third inning, Castillo out there throws a first pitch strike to Jordan Alvarez, who doubled his last time up. And this one's driven to right field. Si, senor. Alvarez way deep to right center field. It's 4 nothing on his 30th jack of the season. That is a big, strong man right there. A big opportunity for the Mariners against the future Hall of Famer, Justin Verlander. And look at this. We're at the bottom of the third, and already everybody's on their feet. Are they into this ball game? Are they into this series? Are they into this season? You better believe it. Everybody on their feet. Towards short, cued. Flip to Altuve. The throw picked. They get the double play. What a play by Pace. To Altuve, the pick by Abreu. Great double play in a massive situation to get the momentum back. Well, that two seamer runs up and in at 96. All kinds of movement. It takes care of Dubon for out number two. And that's more like it for Luis Castillo. Another vicious two seamer in his first clean inning. Bottom of the fourth inning, 4 0 Astros. Verlander back out there. It's Cal Raleigh. Swing and a miss. There is a strikeout for JV. He struck out the side in the second. That's his only other strikeout other than that, than that inning. To get through that inning as quickly as possible. Now JV coming out and doing the same thing. Striking out Teoscar for the second time. That's five strikeouts 
for the future Hall of Famer. Got him upstairs. Strike three. Cheesed him up upstairs. Second time he struck out the side. That's six strikeouts now for Justin Verlander. Four nothing Astros lead Seattle in the top of the six. Tucker has grounded out and flied out. Tucker drills one deep to right field. That one's well tagged and off the scoreboard out there. A bomb to right for King Tuck. All oh, hail the King has driven it into the seats. This ball went over the bleachers in right field. I mean Pena sends one to right for a single here with two outs in the sixth inning. Now it's Dubon. He had an RBI single to start the Astros three run rally in the second. Here's a pitch. Swung on a miss and a breaking ball. Strikeout number eight for Luis Castillo. Damage done by Tucker. A home run. His 29th. Is Trent Thornton on the pitch. Facing Martin Maldonado. Maldonado bidding for his second hit tonight. He's going to find it. A little flare into left field. Drops in in front of Dominic Canzone. Martin Maldonado two for three. A leadoff base runner here in the seventh inning. I've been trying to get on, on track. He's 0 for three. A couple of flyouts and a ground out. One for his last 26. Let's go past him. Wise move. Rojas is step on the bag and on to first base. And Alvarez will have to lead off the eighth. Verlander on the hill. Bottom of the seventh inning. Astros with the 5-0 lead. And he got him for a third time. Justin Verlander striking out Teoscar. Seven strikeouts for JV. Fastball. Bread and butter. Inside corner. Strike three. Eighth strikeout for Verlander. We'll go to the eighth inning. The Astros lead 5-0. Justin Verlander on the mound seeking his 27th career complete game and 10th career shutout. We'll face the 9-1 and 2 hitters. Verlander has had seven perfect innings out of the first eight. Down the right field line. It's a fair ball into the corner. Extra bases for Rojas. It's a ninth inning leadoff double. And Dusty Baker out of the dugout. Verlander's night may be coming to an end. Eight innings plus one batter, three hits allowed. He will walk off the mound with a 5 0 lead. The Astros fans here, and even some of the Mariners fans, giving him a standing ovation on his way to the dugout. That was well done. So one on and one away, and that'll bring up Julio Rodriguez. And the 0 1 to Julio, swinging a pop up into shallow right field, and going over it. Toward the corner is Tucker to make the catch, tagging at third and heading home and scoring is Rojas. Raleigh 0 for 3 tonight. Swing and a miss. Astros win the first game of this big three-game series, 5-1. to one. Brian Abreu gets the final three outs. Justin Verlander, brilliant in eight three-hit innings.